Well, hello again, my equestrian friends. It's me, Lisa, the Budget Equestrian. Welcome back to another video. And I don't know about you. I don't know if you have your horses at home or if you board them, but where we live, we have a small piece of property and I have basically two turnout areas for my horses. One of them is the main pasture, which is hooked onto where they go every single day. And the other one is behind me my pasture out there. I don't know if you can see that behind me or not, but it's kind of been mowed down by the horses and there's really not a lot of grass left. So I decided that I'm going to try and regrow that pasture and make it into a really nice place where the horses can go and be turned out for a little bit and spend some time out back with some actual grass. So like I said, my back pasture is pretty much dirt and this happens every year about this time. The horses have been out there grazing and it just really gets torn up. So with the help of my husband, I decided that we are going to reseed that pasture and see if we can bring it back to life. Now the pasture itself is probably a little less than a quarter of an acre maybe a little bit less than that, but it's a nice area for the horses to get turned out. We have it fenced off so they don't get to go out there all of the time. And in the springtime, it's really nice because there is a lot of green pasture for them to just kind of graze on. Not a lot, but just a little bit. And so even though this probably isn't the best time of year to reseed a pasture, I went ahead and did it. So let me walk you through what I did right now.
And that is pretty much it. That is what I did this past weekend in order to get my pasture ready to grow. I'm hoping it's gonna grow. I don't know, we'll have to see. But I'm planning on making a follow-up video in about three weeks. We'll see how much green grass is out there. I don't know if it's gonna be there. We're gonna find out. From all of the research that we've been doing, it seems like the best way to make sure that our pasture is going to be successful is just to keep it watered. So. That's what we're doing every single day is making sure that the ground stays wet and hopefully that will help the seed to grow. So if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, be sure to subscribe, come back in a couple of weeks and look for the video, Bringing a Pasture Back to Life, part two, and we'll see how it goes. I don't know, this could be a really cool thing or it might be a flop. We'll just have to wait and see.